Hello YouTube, my name is Chris, this is my channel I'm into, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about the Paper Pro, Pencil Pro School Quiet Glow Electric Pencil Sharpener. So recently I wanted to get into digital art, um, but I wanted to create art on paper, the good old fashioned way before then transferring it to say Illustrator and then turning it into digital art. So I looked at many mediums and the mediums that I chose um, were graphite pencils and also colored pencils. And I figured, well, if I'm going to be using a lot of pencils, I want to be saving time sharpening them. I don't want to have to uh, mess around with a manual sharpener. So I was on the lookout for a pencil sharpener, an electric one to be precise. So I looked all around the internet for various reviews on different pencil sharpeners. And the ones I came across, um, they didn't really blow me away. Um, there were things um, with the product that were missing or there's certain aspects of it that I didn't quite like. Uh, for example, the noise. I mean, some of the pencil sharpeners are really noisy, and I couldn't be doing with that. So, um, I, I basically came across this one by fluke, really. I looked on eBay, and all I did was a simple search. It was literally electric pencil sharpener, um, and I looked at the auctions, and this was going fairly cheap and it didn't have long left so I thought well I'll put a bid in to see how it goes and I forgot about it and I actually won it so I was quite chuffed um, so anyway it came to me and I was a little bit skeptical because I thought at the price I won it for surely it can't be up to much but anyway after plugging it in and checking it out I was actually rather surprised. I was very pleasantly surprised indeed, actually. It does a damn good job. So anyway, I went on to Amazon to try and find this sharpener in question, and lo and behold, it had some fantastic reviews. About four and a half star with 28 ratings um, at the time. So yeah, well, very happy indeed. I really wanted a boss stitch sharpener because to me they seemed one of the best sharpeners on the market for the price range um, however I had trouble finding sharpeners from boss stitch but then I looked at the bottom of this box and flipping heck I've realized that paper pro is actually boss stitch so <laughs> I was very very Again, pleasantly surprised with that. Uh, very satisfied indeed. There are a few issues with um, electric sharpeners, apparently anyway. And apparently one of them is um, them chewing up coloured pencils. And this was something I was very wary of because I didn't want it chewing up my expensive pencils. So I had to be absolutely sure that it was the right one for me. And the eBay listing did say that it was okay with coloured pencils, so I went with it. I was also very happy with the features that the company states that it has, including three seconds sharpening. Um, you can replace the cutters, as mentioned before. Um, it has a ten times cutter life. It sharpens quietly. It has tip saver technology. It has auto shut off. It has an alert light. It supports tri write pencils, so like triangular pencils. And it, of course, supports the coloured pencils as well. I mean, it says it sharpens quietly, but. Well, I haven't seen or heard a sharpener that um, sharpens quietly at all yet. I mean, it probably is quieter than most out there, but it still has a good sound to it, shall we say. When the machine works, you can certainly hear that heavy 
duty motor going to work on the pencil. I also like the other little features that it has too, such as the little sucker feet on the bottom that kind of uh, stabilizes it to the desk or surface that you've uh, put it on. Um, the tray, once it's removed, it stops the machine from working. So that's great for um, safety. And when you've um, put your pencil in and it's sharpened it within about three or four seconds, it literally turns itself off. It stops itself from working any further, uh, which basically means it's not going to over sharpen your pencil. So you're not going to be um, wearing down your pencils too quickly. The machine also lights up when it has finished sharpening, which is also a helpful feature. It also states in the features that it has a thermal overload motor protection system in place. I don't properly know what this is, but I would guess that it's going to um, stop the motor from overworking and getting too hot. And as far as the features are concerned, I think the last thing that I can mention is the tray, the shavings tray, is actually rather large. It means you're going to be going for a long time before you're going to have to empty it all into the bin. It has a one year limited warranty, which is nice. This to me means that the company in question, Bostitch, has confidence in their product and the quality control is probably to a high standard. It comes in a fairly sturdy cardboard box and the machine is held in place by two separate bits of cardboard which is really nice and thick um, and this also provides good protection too. When you receive the machine it even comes with a protective film over the housing of it so uh, it's uh, pretty easy to come off as you can see and voila one nice shiny housing so after I tested the machine I pulled the pencil out and looked at my tip end my pencil end and I was very happy at how neat a job it does just take a look at this to make the machine work that little bit harder I even roughed the end of the pencil up and sharpened it using a knife and it made short work of tidying it back up again. I've seen other videos online of people sharpening their pencils in other sharpeners and sometimes you find that the ends, the lead doesn't seem evenly um, you know, sharpened. There's always like a, a bit more wood missing from one side. Um, and I learned that actually it isn't the sharpener that does this and it's down to the quality of the pencil. Sometimes the leads in the centre of the pencil are misaligned and this is what you get. So let's have a listen to um, the sound of the machine when it is working. Now one thing I was a little bit taken back by was uh, it's actually a bit of a chunky monkey this. Uh, it measures um, 18 centimeters by 18 and a half centimeters by 10 and a half centimeters. Um, and yeah, it doesn't half weigh a bit as well. But this is no problem to me. And the weight of it helps to stabilize it. So uh, it's actually a good thing. And so that's the Paper Pro Pencil Pro Skull Quiet Glow Electric Sharpener for you. Um, if you like the products, I've provided the link in the description below. This, of course, is an affiliate link, and I will get a very tiny commission for you purchasing through the link at, of course, no extra cost to you. If you've enjoyed the video and it's been of some use to you, please feel free to hit that like button below. And of course, please subscribe to my channel. I'm always reviewing products and those reviews may be of interest to you too. And so from me, Chris at I'm Into, goodbye for now.